Australia having to work hard and make these tackles in defence. Tyndall. Here comes Kuwaito. He's looking for the offer. He's found it. Croft. One more pass. Might be the score. It is. England have got in. It's Ashton again. And the promise leads to a score. I just think you're doing that move. This is significantly superior to last week's performance against New Zealand. For the simple reason, England seems so much more comfortable on the ball. Who is the modern athlete who made that tackle? This man Lewis could take his pick in 2012 Olympic events. Referee's given a penalty. Youngs has gone quickly again. Flag goes with him. Youngs takes the return pass. England flying after this. And Ashton, the try scorer, is there. Croft as well. And listen to the crowd. Suddenly O'Connor is buried underneath the England bodies. And England go on. They've got a penalty. They might get more. Youngs wants it. Gitto's on the wrong side. That's got to be a yellow card. So I'm playing advantage. You come, you dive on the wrong side. Deliberate and cynical. No argument. You're quite right. sort of burst into life at the end of that game last week and they've continued into this match and that was a tricky one for Flood there's Robinson Robinson drives into Happy there's Bill Genny awaits he marshals everybody behind him Sharp this is opposite number Palmer with another tackle Australia, remember, a man down here. Genia goes himself, and Flood gets across, and it's Palmer once more. And that ball will come back on the England side. The man was turned, and Youngs is looking to go. Laws takes it on. Ashton on the outside. Ashton going up the wing. Takes on the fullback. Who is Mitchell covering? To Gitto, Elson. Oh, another hit on Moore, but he stood firm. And here comes Beal. Beal with one of those chips over the top. Happy's trying to get there, but he won't get there. Nor will Ashton. Beal scores. We have a test match. Boy, do we have a test match. Credit to Australia. England started this half so well, but they have come back. Curly Beal, trademark. He is so quick. And the touch of class about his attacking game. He's flat out. But the quality of his kick at pace is something to behold. Stephen Moore, that's an important offload. Straight as a die, Bill, the clever chip. And Burgess there again to the replacement, certainly playing their part. Moore was the link to Cooper. On again, Adam Ashley Cooper. Bill's outside, must be second score for him now. Not over yet, is it? There is more than a touch of stardust that has been sprinkled on this Australian team. And we've seen that this year. They were given the chance. And for those who thought the scrum was going to dominate, it didn't. It was all the other aspects, and it's all England's day. In the summer, they knew the importance of that win in Australia. And they knew it again today here at Twickenham.